Car Loan For You. We help you sort your car finance before you get to the forecourt. Car Loan For You. Home of the greatest hits. On digital radio. On AM. Online. And on your smartphone. This is... TFM 2. News. Thousands of people across the northeast are back at work today, but have you had enough of your job? Mark Simpson is the managing director of Nigel Wright Recruitment in Newcastle and says January is one of the busiest times of year for career changes. Christmas is a particular time of year where uh, people start to think about their career. They talk to family about their career and they often decide they want to change. So they do see an upturn in activity in January particularly. Well, 25-year-old Gavin Baxter changed jobs to start his own fitness business and says you shouldn't work somewhere that makes you unhappy. I just kind of risked everything. I put everything on the line and thought, if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. But luckily, it has. <laughs> Definitely worth taking that gamble. I mean, I, I'm one of these people, I'm quite a risk taker anyway. <laughs> and I always believe that people should never settle for what they've got. If they're not happy, they just need to go out and change it and move on. Divers have resumed their search for the wreckage of the Air Asia jet near Indonesia eight days after it went missing en route to Singapore. Teams looking for debris of the plane are taking advantage of calmer waters off the coast of Borneo, but say no signal's been detected yet from the black box recorders. Back here, there's been an aggravated burglary in Wall's End. Two men forced their way into an address on Dean Crescent, carrying a knife and a metal pole in the early hours of Sunday morning. A 40-year-old man suffered injuries to his head and arm and is being treated at the RVI in Newcastle. In football, Sunderland are through to the fourth round of the FA Cup. They beat Leeds 1-0 yesterday. Manager Gus Poyet was pleased, but thinks they should have won by a greater margin. Happy with the result, happy with winning, winning at home. Being in the next round of this important cup, uh, I need to be disappointed with the finishing. I think we need to be better in front of her. Meanwhile, Newcastle have confirmed they've cancelled Hayton Benafa's contract. It leaves him free to join the French side Nice. The midfielder has been on loan at Hull. And Downton Abbey star Hugh Bonneville supporting a campaign to save a building used in the TV drama. The old grammar school in Oxfordshire needs renovating to repair damage caused by Rob that's going to cost £250,000. <laughs> TFM2. Get the latest weather updates 24-7 at tfm2.co.uk. After a frosty start, it's going to be milder today. Cloudy and breezy with some drizzle about. Highs of 7 degrees. Tonight will stay cloudy with more rain. That's the latest. I'm Roisin Hasty. This is TFM2. The greatest hits for the North East. Next month over in America, it's the annual Grammy Awards. And a few days after this year's ceremony, there's a very special tribute concert taking place in which some of the music industry's biggest names will honor that man and perform some of his best known songs, including that one, I'm sure. It's Stevie Wonder. I ain't gonna stand for it. Elton John and Kiki D before that. Don't go breaking my heart. Hello, how are you? Welcome to Monday the 5th of January 2015. Happy New Year to you. Welcome to a brand new day. Welcome to a brand new week and welcome to a brand new way to start your mornings. I'm Nick Jackson and on behalf of everybody here, welcome. Welcome to the home of the greatest hits. We're doing New Year's resolutions, aren't we? So our resolutions are as follows. We'll bring you more local news, we'll bring you more local travel information, and best of all, we resolve right here, right now, to play great songs. Lots of them, too, all day and all night. You leave us on and we promise you'll hear music you know and music you love from decades past, and also some hit songs from more recent years as well. Put simply, we'll play the kind of stuff that you love and the kind of stuff that I love. It's gonna be fun, and we're so glad you're up early. This is Ed Sheeran.